on guys it's tyler clean cut lawns hope you're all doing well if you haven't been to this channel before consider hitting that subscribe button um let me know down in the comments below what you use for an angle grinder or what you use to sharpen your blades i personally use an angle grinder the way that my garage is set up it makes it easy just to fasten them down on the on the trailer with a c-clamp or something and do them that way and i'd love to put a bench in here and do a bench grinder or a typical blank grinder but that's just not not happening right now but so anyway i'm going to talk just a few minutes about the makita battery powered angle grinder now this is something makita i guess technically sent me this but i won this in a giveaway on the facebook group lawn life you know scott and those guys run that page and do a do a real good job running that page and i actually happened to win this angle grinder on that page but right here is the charger for the battery you know pretty standard for battery powered equipment um a charger like that and this is a uh, 18 volt angle grinder you know they actually sent me two uh two batteries with it so here is the 18 volt 5 amp battery you know and how it goes on pretty simple and there it's on so that's the whole thing you know it's not not too terribly heavy a little bit heavy but that is a makita brand uh grinder disc as well you know that has a tool in here if i can find where i put it the tool in here to take it off you know you most of you guys are probably familiar you just put that on there put that in the holes hold the button down and turn it to get that blade off i'm not going to do that right now but they sent me you know two batteries and a cutting wheel five inch cutting wheel you can tell it's pretty thin you know the other guard for when you use a cutting wheel i have the grinding disc on there now you know it's kind of neat because it tells you the uh how much battery you got in there i wonder if i put the sorry wrong side tells you how much battery you have left right there so it's pretty neat and i don't have to run extension cords which is probably my favorite part that i don't have to run extension cords but i'm just going to fire it up real quick and make sure that it doesn't hurt my eye or anything when uh i fired up if i put it together correctly but So, and they also sent me this uh, this bag right here to go with it too, which was which was pretty nice of them because I do enjoy having this uh, this grinder, and I can't wait to really put it to the test when I start sharpening blades more often. But uh, since I got it in the winter time, I hadn't got to use it much. But and my mother's been in the shop. But I wanted to show you guys maybe this is something you might be looking into. You know, personally, I like having all the same kind of battery tools because you know. If they all fit the different tools, it just makes it that much easier because I already have the batteries. And batteries seem like they cost, uh, I hadn't looked up the price on this or anything, but the batteries seem to cost just as much or pretty close to it as the tool itself and most battery powered equipment stuff. But just a quick little overview on the Makita battery powered angle grinder. Hope you enjoy videos like this. And like I said, let me know down in the comments below what kind of battery powered or what kind of angle grinder that you prefer and if you prefer batteries or corded or if you prefer a totally different kind of blade sharpener let me know in the comments because i'm always interested in checking all that stuff out but i hope you all have a great day and stay tuned for more videos